Hey, Millie What's gang. What's going on? What's How going on? How y'all doing? What's going on, Millie's? What is happening? So y'all know what time it is. Scorpio. Scorpios. Time for that Scorpio energy. Where the Scorpios at? Drop that Scorpio love in the comments. Drop that love in the comments for the Scorpios. Yes. So we got some grilled chicken and some grilled corn. I ain't even really throwing no seasoning. I should have hooked it up. I figured it was already sweet though. What? The corn. Mm. We're gonna see, I guess. Right, but we got some grilled chicken, as y'all see. Yeah, I love some grilled, grilled chicken. chicken. Oh man, yeah, I just did that. Love grilled I just did that. Grill some chicken, some fresh corn. So let us go ahead and say grace real quick. Mm -hmm. Amen. Okay. Well. Let's get a thumbnail then. You know how you want to do this, right? Uh, you want to hold the corn, you want to hold the cheek. I'm going to get me. You want to get your couple pieces? Hold it up. Piece. Okay, go ahead. Let me do it. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. All right. Alright, so. Yeah, let's get to it. Let's get right on in this video, y'all. Let's get in. Scorpio starts from October 23rd to November 21st. November 21st? Mm-hmm. It's okay. a feminine energy as well. Feminine energy? Yeah. Yep. Mm -hmm. mm. Um, it's a fixed sign. So the fixed sign mean it's stuck in a web. Mm hmm Yeah. You know? So what's the element sign? Water. Water sign. Mm hmm Water sign. Yeah, they're a water sign. Scorpio people is emotional. My notes out. Yeah. The emotional. Mm hmm Emotional. So, but uh, Scorpios is one of the most determined sign. Yeah, I can see that. Yeah. 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 The most determined. They ruling planet is Pluto. Okay. So the ruling planet is Pluto. Um, a couple of strengths y'all got. Very brave. Y'all mm -hmm. very brave. Scorpios are brave. They're not scared to take that they risk. Still ain't. They'll take the risk. They ain't scared of nothing. I mean, no risk, no reward, right? Scorpios? That's how they feel. No risk, no reward. The bigger the risk, the bigger the reward. So they brave. Mm hmm They brave. So. They, they, um, also is very emotional, though. They're water sign. So they're very emotional, too. But Scorpios are known to be psychics as well. So, because they're very intuitive water signs, you know, they're in tune with their emotions, like. They very mm -hmm. loyal as well. Mm-hmm. They is another loyal sign, you yeah. know. They are loyal. And generous as well. Yeah. Very generous people. Very loyal, generous, kind. honest. Yeah. They honest. They brutally honest, too. Yeah, they are. You know what I'm saying? Like it is honest. Mm-hmm. Show me this game. They don't shoot for nothing. Mm -mm. Tell you like it is. You know what I mean? 
who want who don't who wants somebody around that's gonna always tell you yes and they need to tell you no, like you know what I'm saying, or tell you what it is. Tell you be honest. You want somebody around you that's gonna give you honest feedback, right? Most yeah, definitely. You know, sense of you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you do. Yeah, you want honest feedback, so Scorpio's very honest. Yeah. Scorpio's rule uh beginnings and end. So like things that like that could be in anything like a job and the beginning of the job, the end of the job or you know, it can be anything. But that's what it um Scorpio represents. Beginnings and ends. And um They are very ambitious. Very ambitious. I mean, they go getters. They go getters, y'all. Scorpio. Uh, their body. Their body parts are ruled by the genitals. Genitals. Is it genitals? Their body part. Mm-hmm. Genitals. So y'all know what that means. Always be safe. Be cautious who you uh, share that energy with. Mm -hmm. You know, be cautious who you share that energy with. That's a sacred energy. Yeah, because. Um, so, yep. Yeah. You just know, you know, they're also um, are easily to get, to get UTIs. Okay. You know, because of the genitals, so. Since they rule by that. Scorpios are very imaginative. Meaning, they have a great imagination. You know, they have a great imagination. Uh, good at innovating. Thinking of good ideas, new ideas. So they got a, a good imagination and very imaginative. So, I mean, to me, I think that's very good because it's like you can actually be creative, you know? You being creative. Imaginative is being creative. Mm -hmm. They got new ideas. Seeing. You know, you got to be able to see it. Mm -hmm. That's the thing. You got to be able to see it mm -hmm. in your mind before it can happen. You can't right. see it. You can't have it. You know. Um, their opposite sign is Taurus. Taurus. So, yeah. Okay. So you know how they say Taurus people are like can deal can they handle their emotions quite really well. Mm -hmm. Scorpios is the opposite. Okay. So they they don't tend to hold they get you know, they're emotional people. They independent people as well. Scorpio mm -hmm. tend independent. to be very independent. Mm -hmm. Very strong. Independent, you when know. They strive, they gonna strive to go get their goal. Like I said, yep. Mm -hmm. They ambitious. They gonna get a goal. They independent. They gonna do it by themselves, you know. So I mean, they also uh, have a powerful presence. Mm -hmm. You know, you gonna know. You you can feel their presence when they there. Scorpios have a powerful presence as well. They can be clingy too. They can be clingy, very clingy people. When they love you. Yeah, they tough-minded yeah. as well. Tough-minded. Uh, like I said, powerful. They also crave intimacy. I can see that. Them being emotional. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Crave. They crave intimacy. So y'all, y'all got Scorpio significant other. Show them some love. 
They might all not. All your people, all your Scorpio people, show them some love. They they tough minded, so they they very tough minded. So they might not, you know what I'm saying? Always come off as, you know, as two instrument, but they are they crave it. So yeah, show them love. Mm -hmm. Now, in the same sense of them craving that love like that, they also get very jealous. That's one of their negative traits. They can be, they can become jealous and possessive. When they weaknesses, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. And then, yep, yeah. they um, they can be forceful. Mm hmm Very controlling. They could be intimidating. Uh, you know as well. And these are part of the weaknesses, the weakness, mm -hmm. the weak traits. Jealous, resentful, you know what you cold. When they and are emotional. They are. And uh, Scorpios also like when they're at a when they're not evolved, they tend to um they tend to um they not a lost train of thought. They tend to hmm, but yeah, they could be emotional. Uh, they could even be aggressive. So I mean, uh, as well as possessive, mm -hmm. they they possessive about what's theirs, you know. Yeah. Yeah, they possessive about what's theirs. But as well. Scorpio people are. Hmm. It's like you know, like they are protectors too, though. You know, like. They're more so, um, I want to say they're like a sour patch too. They could be really, really sweet and, like I said, loyal. They're finishers, you know, too. Like they're going to achieve their goal, whatever it is that they're going to be working on, they're going to achieve it. They're clever, very clever people. Smart, yeah, very intellectual. Oh, yeah, look, it's popping on me. <laughs> oh, I don't. But um, they lucky days is Tuesday. Tuesday. <coughs> lucky day Tuesday. Number is lucky numbers is two and four. Okay, I like number two. They used to be my uh, <coughs> number. Mhm. Mm <laughs> Back in uh, middle school playing basketball, that was my number. Mhm. Mm Lucky two, number two. I think they're um, magical color, maybe burgundy. Mm. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. I know some of their colors is uh, yellow, red, and orange too, though. Okay. So the magical color is burgundy. Mm-hmm. That's so, the difference. Mm-hmm. Mm. Burst on is so the past difference. too. Let me tell you the difference. When we say magical, like birthstone or color, think of it like <clears throat> colors you can wear when colors you can wear when um like to an interview. You know what I'm saying? Like on a Tuesday, wear burgundy because it's gonna it's like gives you like good luck and stuff. So that's what we mean by magical. Right. So uh, they burst on was topaz. Uh, mm -hmm. That symbolizes intellectual as well. That stone keeps uh, negativity away. Mm -hmm. So if y'all got any of those stones. Most definitely keep that crystal charged. Mm -hmm. Keep that negativity away. <laughs> Ooh, so those energies high all the time. But um, Scorpio people is known to be like like they say they will be good surgeons, scientists. Um, I think even psychologists too, aren't they? Um, maybe so. They very tough minded. Man. Very tough minded. Yeah. And spiritual leaders. Because mm. Scorpios are, they can be psychic, so. 
I had my fair share of Scorpios being very, uh, having like psychic abilities. So. Um, definitely, especially while they're younger. A couple, um, a couple famous people. A couple celebrities. Celebrities. <coughs> Y'all may know is P. Diddy, Future, Sierra. Um, okay. I think Drake is too. Right. I think Drake is a Scorpio too. Right. He had that little sweater. Yeah. My man, Lil Boosie. Lil Boosie. Lil Boosie. I know he said that in the song. I'm a Scorpio, so I'm not the get a bow. Y'all know so what's next after yeah. that. Yeah. Oh, that's what I was going to say about Scorpio people. Scorpio people always gonna get revenge. <laughs> always. Like what we said in that song, he said what? I'm a Scorpio, unforgivable. He unforgivable. You play with me right? next time out. Hey. Yeah, they they gonna get. They are going to <laughs> get their revenge, and yeah. it could be well. a long time ago. But they always gonna get revenge. They seek revenge. But yeah, the, yeah, that's a negative trait, y'all. So mm -hmm. y'all know what to do with that, and why we tell y'all these. And you know what I'm saying. And so, it ain't even. It might not even just be for you. But if you know a Scorpio that's like may have came off at like that, then you can understand that. You know, they just right. They that way. Yeah. Why yeah. they like that anyway? Yeah, you can just understand people a little bit better. It ain't. It's nothing mm -hmm. personal towards a person who's like that. Because like I said, there's plenty of other things that's in your chart. Right. Remember to look up y'all chart. Have y'all if y'all look haven't looked it up yet. Check that chart out. Cause when we get deeper, you want y'all to know. And not only that chart, you know what I'm saying? Uh study find out more about the universal laws of the Akashic records. Uh, a couple of things we'll be talking about. The consciousness, understanding the consciousness, the densities the the, the densities that we in, the, the levels of consciousness. So, I mean, it's a lot, you know what I'm saying, to this, so, but we want y'all yeah. to have a head, a head start, though, so. Yeah, look into those things. And if you don't want to, just keep watching. Yeah, you know, that's why we trying to make sure we drop some other content for y'all, too, as well. You, know? you should look, definitely look into meditating if you don't have not done that yet. I highly suggest all you guys meditate yeah. 10 minutes 15 minutes off the day you know that's right. not that long right so. and, and then let me tell you though <clears throat> another another form of meditation is contemplation in prayer mm -hmm. meditation contemplation and prayer yes you, prayer you, what are you is doing is trying to yeah they, they all have the kind of overall same. the same concept because what you try when you meditate you meditate to a certain frequency or to a certain vibration, you're trying to bring something to existence or get a peace of mind. You know what I'm saying? So when you're praying, you, you're doing the same thing. You're trying to get a peace of mind. You're trying to ask for what you need so you can get that peace of mind. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, mm -hmm. like I said, contemplation <laughs> as well. <clears throat> Sitting there in the days, contemplating that time alone by yourself, you get to contemplate. Yeah, you when, you, when you spend that time alone, you get to contemplate. Yeah. You know, and think about, you know, more. You know? Yeah. So. Definitely. But yeah, so we're gonna end this video. Yeah, we ain't gonna take that. up too much of y'all time. No. But we wanted to highlight y'all about the Scorpios. Yeah, for sure. Drop the Scorpios and like I said, I don't don't y'all don't take offense to any of the negative traits if no. you don't have them. Right. Channel that energy you know, to positive. If the shoe don't if the shoe don't fit, don't wear it. Right. More than likely, it resonated with a different, you know what I'm saying, a characteristic, a different sign. Mm -hmm. So, with that, y'all being, we appreciate y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, comment, and subscribe. And, subscribe. and we go. See y'all.